Doing good, I'm your host Jason. In this video, I will be showing you how to set up a merch store with Fortwall. Fortwall is one of my favorite platforms, as on it you'll be able to create a merch store for completely free that you can start selling your products. Whether it is a case that you'd like to sell physical products or digital products or membership, you can do that using this platform. All you'll need to do is go on to fortwall.com. Once you have done that, I want you to tap on get started now. From there, you can quickly sign up using your YouTube account or any other social media account. Once you're finished signing up, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. Once on this dashboard, all you'll need to do now is go across to the left hand menu option and you're going to tap on products. After selecting products, you're going to tap on create new product. From here, you have three different options. You can either choose to design something new, which is what we are going to be doing since we'll be selling merch. But if it is a case that you wanted to sell something you already have, for example, a physical product, you could do that. If it is a case that you wanted to sell a digital product, you could select sell digital product. So we're going to tap on design something new. After you have done that, you'll be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you can see the different options or you could tap on all products from the top navigation bar. After tapping on all products, you can see the different categories on the left hand menu option right here. So if it is a case that you'd like to sell eco-friendly clothes, champion or so on, you can select any one of these options. If you'd like to sell accessories or so on, you can select that. So once you have found something that you'd like to sell, so let's say for example, I would like to create my design on this t-shirt. All I would need to do is simply select the t-shirt right here. Then after doing that, I'm going to tap on design now. After selecting design now, you'll be redirected to a new page. And this is a design that I had uploaded earlier. But to create a design, I would normally recommend that you go onto canva.com. Canva.com is a platform that you can use for completely free to create designs. Once on Canva, let's say we are creating a t-shirt design. All we'll need to do is simply type in t-shirt. Then we can select t-shirt right there. After typing in t-shirt, you'll be redirected to this page. On this page, you'll see numerous templates that you can choose from. All you'll need to do is scroll down until you see a template of your liking. And from there, you can select to edit it. Let's say, for example, this template right here. After you have selected the template, all you'll need to do now, I'm going to be using this one. All you'll need to do now is tap on customize this template. Once you have tapped on customize this template, you'll be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you can add your own personal touches. So for example, I could change the text right here if I want. So you can see right here, Adrenaline and Partners. I'm going to be changing that right there. And I'm going to change it to, for example, just get it. So I'm going to type that in right there. You could add other customization to your liking, but I don't want to draw out this tutorial. Once you're finished, you're going to tap on Share in the top right hand corner, then tap on Download. Then you'll tap on Download once more. After doing that, if it is a case that you'd like to remove the background and make the logo transparent, what I would recommend you do is open a new tab and you're going to type in remove.bg. This is a platform that will allow you to remove the background of your new design. So I could select the design, tap on open. After you have done that, you'll give it a few seconds. Then you can see right there, the background has now been removed. Once that has happened, you'll tap on download. Then from here, you're going to go back into Fort Wall and you'll tap on upload image. After you have tapped on upload image, you can either choose to select the image without the background or you can select the one with the background. I'm going to be selecting the one without the background, then tap on open. And you can see it right here. It has been added. You can also choose whether you like to add it onto the back, the sleeve, or you like to add it onto the right sleeve. Once you're finished, you're going to simply tap on next. 
then from there i'll tap on continue with current quality after you have done that you'll be redirected to a new page on this new page you'll be able to add your product name so you could add in your product name right there you can also type out a description if you want then from there you can select your selling price once you're finished you're going to tap on publish now in the top right hand corner after tapping on publish now you'll be redirected to a new page and this is how your store page looks at the moment as you can see right here if it is a case that you would like to edit it you could tap on edit or you can choose to copy the url and you can start sharing it so persons can come onto your store and make a purchase so if we were to tap on edit right here it would carry us back to this page and we could tap on site design from the left hand menu option and from here you could edit your website so you could change the banner image you can also tap on logo and identity from the left hand menu option and upload a logo of your liking you can also change the color and appearance as you can see there are numerous editing options that you are provided with on the left hand menu option right here once you are finished you will tap on coming soon in the top right hand corner then select live and your website will now be live hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative and by the way to set up your payment options all you'll need to do is tap on settings from the left hand menu option after tapping on settings from here you're going to tap on billing and payout then you'll see set up your payouts you can tap right here so you can receive payouts you can also tap on payment method and this is the methods that will be used to cover giveaways and refunds as you can see right here hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe